With the Spurs up one to nothing in this Western Conference semifinal matchup with the Trailblazers, Thursday night, time for game two. And there was an unwanted guest in Portland's locker room. That is Thomas Robinson, I guess, thinking about his little locker mate beforehand. And the smooth transition to R.C. Buford, receiving the award for the executive of the year. And early in the first, Tiago's splitter with the offensive rebound. Tony Parker finds Kawhi Leonard, and he'll knock it down from the corner. He had 12 points in the first quarter alone, and that, by the way, was one of 19 Spurs assists just in the first half. And in the final seconds of the first quarter, Damian Lillard beating the buzzer, as he usually does, to cut San Antonio's lead to three. And the Spurs reserve scored 27 points in the first half of game one. And no surprise, 27 points in the first half of game two as well. Off the miss, Boris Diaw headed the other way, laying it in, plus the foul. And later, Tiago Splitter with the rebound, and he'll kick it out to find Marco Bellinelli, who knocks it down. The Spurs went on a 23-6 run to start the second quarter. And meanwhile, Marcus Aldridge struggling, missing the dunk here. It was 3 of 10 from the field and had just 8 points in the first half. And yes, that is another missed dunk. Later in the second, Robin Lopez blocked by Tim Duncan. Tony Parker headed the other way. And he'll finish this one in the paint all by himself. The Spurs outscored the Blazers 41 to 25 in the second quarter. But Wesley Matthews provided the spark that Portland needed in the third. Knocking down the three, he had 10 points in the third quarter alone. But LaMarcus Aldridge continuing to struggle. He caught his own miss, and then he was called for traveling. It heads the other way. And here, he's called for the offensive foul. Heather Cox talked to Greg Popovich. Right after LaMarcus Aldridge scored 32 points in game one, you've held him to 12. How have you been able to contain him so far? I have no clue. It's working. Simple enough. And Portland chipping away at the deficit in the fourth. Damian Lillard flipping in the wild shot. And off the Tony Parker turnover. Headed the other way, Wesley Matthews lobbing it to Nicholas Batum for the lay-in. A 10-3 run by Portland there. But the Spurs answer with a 13-2 run. That's Tony Parker driving by Damian Lillard, stopping and sinking the floater. And Manu Ginobili. Driving and kicking out to Kawhi Leonard for the three. And here's Ginobili with a little bit of action of his own. He'll pull up from the wing and go ahead and knock it down. That was 50 total points for San Antonio and just 19 for Portland's bench. The Spurs win at 114 to 97 and take a 2 to nothing lead over Portland. Game three is Saturday in Portland.